In this video, I'm going to answer the question, is selling covered call options a good strategy? I'm going to do this by sharing with you a covered call position that we've been in over the past three and a half months to help you see the kind of returns you can get by selling covered call options. This knowledge will help you decide if doing covered call options is a good strategy for you. Hello everyone and welcome back to My Life of Learning. My name is Randy Perez. Please know that I am not a financial advisor and this video is not meant to be investment advice of any kind. I am, however, a 22 plus year stock and option trader as well as real estate investor. Covered call option trading is one of my favorite option trading strategies that I use to generate cash flow and returns. I'm excited to show you the kind of returns you can receive using covered calls to help you decide if it's a strategy that you should be using in your trading account. Before we get started, I just ask one thing of you. Please hit the like button to support this channel. I'm about to give you some really awesome information and I know you're going to find great benefit in it. So if you appreciate the kind of material I provide for you on this channel, please support it by hitting the like button. Thank you for that and let's get started. Here you see one of the covered call positions we are in right now in Realty Income ticker symbol O. In the red box you see that at the top line that we have sold the April 16th $65 call options. Next column over under position, you see that we're short three covered call options, which matches up to the 300 shares we own just below that. In the next column to the right, market value, you see that those three covered call options that we have sold are currently worth $128 total, and we're about two weeks out from expiration right now. The next column to the right of that, under market price, you see that each of those options is worth just over 42 cents per share. In the final column in the red box on the right, under average price, you see that we are paid 69 cents per share for selling those covered call option contracts. If you look down at the bottom left here in the yellow rectangle, you see that Realty Income is currently trading for $64.10 per share. And to the far right of that in the yellow box, you see that Realty Income's current dividend yield is 4.4% per year. Here you see the daily chart of Realty Income over the past 11 months or so. In just a moment, I'm going to show you all the trades we've done in Realty Income over the same time frame. But for reference, you see that in the white box on August 19th of last year, we began selling put options in Realty Income. Fast forward three months to the yellow box, and on November 19th, with Realty Income trading around $60 per share, we were assigned those three put option contracts at $65 per share. As you can see in the rest of the chart, which goes through today, Realty Income has basically gone sideways. It's fluctuated between $57 per share up to right at our short strike price of $65 per share. Here you see a list of all the trades and dividends that we have done and received since we started selling put options in Realty Income. In the red box, you see all the put options that we sold from August 19th until November 19th when Realty Income was put into our account at $65 per share. At the blue box, you see that we bought those shares at $65 per share. And in the orange box below that, you see all all the income that we have received from selling covered call options as well as collecting dividends since November 19th. In all, we are out of pocket. As you can see just below that orange box on the bottom, we are out of pocket right at $17,166 for these 300 shares that are put into our account. So our cost basis is right at $57.22 per share. Remember that Realty Income is currently trading for $64.10. So we're already up in this position that we've been trading in over the past seven months. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that most of the stocks we trade in are dividend paying stocks like Realty Income. We do trade in other stocks other than dividend stocks, but predominantly the portfolio of stocks that we track and that we trade options on are dividend paying stocks. One of the reasons for that is that as you can see here, we've already received four dividends since the stock was put into our account. One of the nice things about Realty Income is that it pays a monthly dividend as compared to how most companies, most companies pay a quarterly dividend. We already lined up to receive a fifth dividend because you can see here in the red box on the top line, Realty Income went X dividend yesterday on March 31st. So we'll receive that dividend on, as you can see in the line below that, on April 15th. In the blue box, you see this dividend is again just over 23 cents per share. I wanted to give you all the information on this covered call position so that we can then talk through and answer the question asked in the title of this video, is selling covered calls a good strategy? In my opinion, selling covered calls is a good trading strategy and here's why. Like you, I like to make money. And I know how hard it is to make money. So when I invest or trade, I want to do it in such a way that I minimize the potential for us to lose that hard earned money. Over the years I've been trading stocks and options, I've tried almost every option trading strategy there is. 
I've come to the conclusion that my two favorites are number one, to sell put options of stocks that I would feel comfortable owning at a price that I'd be happy if it were put into my account. And then number two, once those stocks are put into my account, I then begin selling covered call options against the stock that I own. When realty income was put into our account, if we had just let it sit there and done nothing to generate cash flow in return, we would have pretty much been down on this trade. However, by merely selling call options like we have done and also collecting dividends, we have turned a potentially losing position into a cash flow machine. So we don't get just one stream of income each month from selling covered call options. We get another one because we're receiving the dividends that realty income pays to its owners. So every month we are lowering our call spaces because we are collecting cash from dividends and the call options that we are selling. Now royalty income is back up pretty close to where the stock was put into our account at $65 per share. So we'll just have to see how this plays out. I plan to roll this covered call option out for another month sometime in the next couple of weeks and we'll just keep this party going as long as we can get nice premium and return by rolling these covered call options. In all, we've been paid $7.78 per share from selling put options and then once the stock was put into our account, switching its position over to a covered call position and selling covered call options while we collected that monthly dividend. If we had bought the stock outright at $65 per share, we'd actually be down on this overall position right now. However, because we've used options, including selling covered call options, once realty income was put into our account, we we're actually up in this position. By the way, if that was really useful, what I just share with you, then I would love it if you just give this video a like. Just bump the like button. And thank you very much for doing that. Selling covered calls and stocks that you own is, in my opinion, an awesome way to make money on a consistent monthly basis. As you've seen, selling covered call options can turn a losing position into a winner. Covered call options can turn a position that may go sideways on you for months or even years into a cash flow machine. It's, in my opinion, the second best way to trade using options in the markets. If you'd like to receive alerts as soon as we make trades similar to the trades I talk through in Realty Income, consider the benefits of becoming a patron at the link in the description below. If you'd like to see more details on how you can use selling covered call options to generate awesome cash flow in return, check out the series at the link above in the description below entitled Covered Call Option Trading. Until next time, happy investing, and we'll see you again soon.